All right, guys, I took all my extra blocks that I built my house with. These blocks are about it's probably four or five years old. And uh, we've taken them out here to this remote area. And we're gonna do some target practice tomorrow and see, just do a simple ballistic test and have some fun. shooting some blocks and see how well these things hold up with some different calibers of bullets. We're gonna have some fun today. All right, guys, that's a 270. That's my hunting gun. And you can see, look at that. The block stopped it. It went way up in there. It's probably gone in up there a good eight inches, six to eight inches. But you can see the pumpkin that the kids named Harry is unscathed. So look at this. The block actually pushed through, but it didn't go all the way through the block. I would say that these blocks are definitely bulletproof. I'm gonna shoot in one of the joints now and see if the joint will go through. So I'll go right here in this joint and see if it will go through the joint. So we've done five shots and you can see how well these blocks are actually holding up to that big old round shooting in the general one area. I would definitely say these blocks are bulletproof. Look how far that went up in there. Way up in there. We can see that Harry is doing good. The blocks are still pushing out just a little bit. That's the slug, 20 gauge slug that we're shooting at those blocks. Look how big that is. So it had a little more damage than that 270. Look at that. But that was uh, four shots that I put into that thing in one spot. Let's go to the back, let's check on Harry. Harry's still smiling.
All right, guys, that was 30 rounds through a, with a 223 shooting in the same spot that the 12 gauge, or excuse me, the 20 gauge and uh, a lot of my other rounds that I've been shooting. And you can still see the wall is holding up, but there's a big hole there, that's for sure. But that's just in one concentrated area, guys. That's amazing that that block is holding up. Let's check on Harry. All right. Harry is still smiling. He's got a little dust on him. He had a little shrapnel in the eyeball down there by the chin. Other than that, Harry's doing okay. Harry has been shot in the eye. Harry! Oh, you could see where the hole went. We feel bad for Harry. I think he's crying. No. He's crying. He doesn't want to be back here. He's scared. What do you guys think of that wall so far? Good. Does that make you feel safe in our house? Yeah. Ooh, that's a, that's the 40. Yeah. That's the 40 caliber. That's pretty good. It's well intact still. All right, guys. So we're just going to let the kids have a blast with the 22s. We got three guns and we're going to let them just go to town. You ready? Ready. You ready? He's got the scope now, so he's shooting everything with the scope. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Die, Blocky. One, two, three. <laughs> you want us to fire now? Fire whenever. You got another one? <coughs> Look, this little bead, you want to put it right in the bottom of that little groove and put that on your target. Put that bead on your target when it's in the bottom of that little groove and you're going to nail that can. You lean your head down there like that and with this eyeball, with this eyeball, you look down right here and put that little bead on there. Get hairy. Aim, hey, aim. <laughs> Ethan was the first one to get hairy. He got it in the bottom of the jaw. Good job, Ethan. <laughs> one. Two, three, four, last one, five. Oh, and I got him twice. I got him a couple times. I'm like, <laughs> yeah, he's going through that hole. He's no longer protected by the blocks. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I need some ear <laughs> I think Harry's become a jack-o'-lantern.
All right, guys. That is almost a full day of shooting at this block. I don't know how many rounds we've shot at this thing. Hundreds of rounds, different calibers. And this was just a dry stack. You got bullet holes everywhere in here, but it's pretty big. Hi. <laughs> We're gonna see if we can blast the rest of this down. So the whole purpose of this video guys is we just wanted to show you how strong this block is with a ballistic test. We didn't have any official testing going on. We just had a lot of fun shooting at these blocks and you can see how well they held up. And uh, even though we don't have the center of our wall, that's where we were primarily shooting. We shot hundreds of rounds through the center of that wall and uh, that block held up pretty darn good in my opinion. All right, guys, that's the end of our shooting. We want to thank you guys for watching our video. If you haven't already, hit that like button. If you haven't uh, subscribed yet, consider subscribing to our channel. So thanks, guys, and we'll catch you on the next video. Don't worry, guys. We'll clean up our mess. We're not going to leave the forest all tore up like other guys that do poor shooting habits. We are cleaning up our mess. Thanks guys, see you later.